Hey guys, Neon FX here, and I'm about to start my new Let's Play of Lost Kingdoms 2 for the Nintendo GameCube. And, uh, before we start, I'm just gonna quickly show you my old file. This is from back in the day, where I used to play this game quite a bit. <laughs> but we're gonna start a new game, and we'll play this from the beginning. So let's do this. This first uh, cutscene is pretty cool, so I won't do uh, much speaking during this. I'm just going to let you watch. Alright, so um, to anyone who's unfamiliar with this game, this is a real-time RPG where we uh, collect demon cards and use them for battle. Um, yeah, the reason I chose to uh, let's play Lost Kingdoms 2, I've played both uh, Lost Kingdoms 1 and Lost Kingdoms 2 and out of the two I preferred this. And this is one of my favorite RPGs from the Nintendo GameCube alongside uh, Tales of Symphonia and Skies of Arcadia. But yeah, out of all three, uh, this one hasn't been let's played all that much, so I decided to uh, go with this one. Uh, welcome to really long text intro. Um, I usually skip this, but in case you want to read up on the uh, storyline, I'll leave this run so you can read it. Okay, I think that's coming to an end, so let's start this. Here we go, first mission. Yeah, I've decided not to uh, read most of the text, but I will talk to most of the people. The All right, so um, we start this with our uh, pretty weak cards, but as we progress, uh, can you take out the monsters on the other side but don't? Sure, why not? As we progress, obviously, we get stronger cards. You know how RPGs work. <laughs> I don't need to explain that to you. 
But yeah, there's uh, several different types of cards. My favorites being the weapons and the summon type cards. Now, I'm using the uh, weapons type cards right now, and he's a uh, single hit. Uh, we've also got independent cards, which I'll show you pretty quickly now. Independent cards, they attack of their own free will, which I don't use them as often because it's like you have to rely on them, which I don't like to do. This is why I prefer these weapon cards right here. And there are also helper cards, which kind of like heal you during battles and such. Yeah, this first level is pretty short. This is uh, kind of like the boss of this level, so we'll take him out pretty quickly. Don't provide too much challenge. And I always get um, a two-star ranking on this level for some reason. Um, all these levels out of a three-star rating, and the higher rating you get, the more cards you get at the end of the level, which I'll show you now. Alright, that's the first mission. Ah, uh, finally, there you are. That's Victor. Oh, uh, successful operation for the band of the he Scorpion, looks out for us. You. Hey, what did I say? Confound that girl. She won't even accept thanks. But no problem, as long as she keeps doing her job. Alright, so yeah, mission ends. We get to choose our cards. And it's going to be a two star ranking. Two star rating. What did I tell you? And <laughs> I get the two worst cards. Like, these cards are pretty useless right here, beaker cards. I'm usually pretty unlucky with these card selections, but hey. Well, let's uh, go to the next level. <coughs> yeah, these uh, artwork on the loading screen is pretty cool, I reckon. Okay, so uh, this level... Um, sort of acts as your tutorial, it tells you what's going on in the game. Yeah, so it despise you. Ooh, treasure. We have a porcu pig. That's an independent type, which I don't like to use. But thanks anyway. Um, this is the way I want to go. I already know all this stuff. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I'm going to show you how to get a pretty strong card right here. Okay, you see this bank? Well, this dude here, he bets you that you cannot throw a card all the way to the other side of that bank. Which is pretty easy to do. And if you do this, he will give you an elephant card, which is a very powerful summons card. And we will be using that at the end of this level, I can guarantee you. Oh yeah, the magic stones, um, when you're fighting these enemies, it's pretty important to pick them up. Magic stones are needed for summoning your demons during battles. Um, you can summon them without magic stones, but it takes away your health, so it's best to like try and pick them up as you battle. Which gets a lot more difficult as you can imagine as the game progresses. Right now it's like pretty easy battles. I could just like run away from these guys but like whatever. I'll take them all out. Maybe I'll get a better rating if 
from like taking them out. Ow. That wasn't very nice. You're about to die, you do realize. Uh... Oh, that did not finish him off. There we go. Right. Ah, yeah, there's a treasure chest down here. Let's talk to this guy. Do you think I could do it? No. I don't think you can do it. <clears throat> Man trap. Ah, that's pretty weak uh, independent card right there. I'll probably use them for the beginning part of this game. But Actually, I'm going to run past these guys and just get to uh, the final section right now. Red lizards. Okay, Dak points. These are very handy because not only do they heal you, but uh, they let you uh, sort out your deck. So any cards you find during missions, you can just add and strengthen your deck, like so. All right. So um. Let's head into the final area, and before we do that, I just want to uh, find that card right there. That's the one I wanted. This is the powerful summons card that we got from uh, throwing the cards over to the back. And this does a lot of damage. But not enough, because... These guys are pretty tough. We can take them out. No worries, man. No worries. Okay, I'm gonna have to use, like, independent types. As well as my weapons, because otherwise I'm gonna, like, just run out of cards. Oh, I completely missed that hit right there. Okay, he's down to a third health. Um, am I out of weapons cards? Oh, level up. And he is down. Mission end. That is nice. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, and the three star ranking. That is what I'm talking about. We get to choose three cards. I'll probably choose the wrong ones. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that always happens, so <laughs> I'm kinda used to it. So yeah, um that was part one of Let's Play Lost Kingdoms. Uh the next part we'll head into this town of Kidishu. If that's how it's pronounced, I'm not sure. But yeah, I'll see you next time for the next part. See ya!